All right, it is Thursday afternoon with the Pet Connection in Ocean Springs. Dad's like, you just finished pulling maggots out of a turtle. Why would you want to put that on video? And, and Dad is smarter than I'm giving him credit for. It. All right, let me see if I can make this a little bit bigger. Holding turtle in one hand. There we are. Hey, dude. All right, there's our hole. Not seeing any more maggots, but there is some hyperpigmentation in there, which definitely tells us it's been going on for a while. And you really can't suture these things up. That would just not be, a, would be very uncool. There you go, stretch your neck out. Let's see if we can see some more in there. I've already gotten quite a few out. But you're cute. You are like super cute. All right, let's get your hand now. You can bring it in. All right, I'm gonna pack that with some antibiotics, okay? All right, you hold on. Just the one. So here's our maggot load from that little guy. This is his one maggot, so the other's turtle. We're gonna let him make a big deal of counting these things, but I don't care. <laughs> we got them out, they're out of the turtle. We'll put that antibiotic in there. That should make any of them in there want to leave. In the meantime, we'll keep from getting infected for a while. So well, here's the bad news. These maggots are known to be in turtles. We don't even know exactly what species of fly lays them, but for some strange reason, our local Terrapin Carolinas have been plagued by these things for at least the last, last 50 years. So we'll get you to feeling good and hopefully get you set free. All right, hold on. All right, here we go. I'm gonna try to do this antibiotic pack and hold the camera at the same time. Put that right in there. I wonder if that burns. Well, if you do turtle, do you do birds? Yes. Turtles, birds, snakes, rabbits. Yeah, we sutured up a snake in here just a little while ago. Mm -hmm. Well. Rat snake. Haven't had any birds, no, any damage in it. It's just that one year a tree in the yard, the limb broke, and it broke where there was a nest at. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah. Well, I do a lot of doctoring, but when it comes to raising the baby birds, I'll least turn that over to, uh, to the wildlife centers. Wild at heart is the primary yeah. one for the area. I know the wildlife, they don't take them anymore. Last time I called, I had to go up there north of that and say Escatawa area. Right, I'm going to roll them over, give them a going little tap. The, going to the east side of 63 out in the country. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get it out of your eye, bud. <laughs> Certainly not repeating his motion anymore. You're so weak. Listen, I'm out of here. This is the second one that I found so far this year. All right, there you go, little buddy. Bye-bye. Oh